Abdul Fattah Wissahaku made his Champions League debut for his club side. Mohamed Salah came off the bench to score a hat trick in five minutes. Interesting night of Champions League football that saw Dennis Odoi and Kamal Sua qualify for the round of 16 with Club Bruges, who were top of their group after match day four. They have 10 points. However, Kamal Sua saw red after two yellow cards compounded in him being sent off. We'll look at the performances of Ghanaian players tonight in the Champions League as well as some results that made the headlines. As usual, subscribe if you have not, and click on the notification bell to get more updates. Match day four of the Champions League took place tonight and it was some Ghanaian players on display. Isahaku made his debut for his club side Sporting CP. They lost after going a man down in the 22nd minute after Fatah Isahaku got the chance to play in his very first Champions League game. However, he could not help his side salvage a point at least. They lost 2-0 in their game. They have a chance, still a slim one albeit that, to qualify from the group. But uh, Isaku got his first taste of European football at the highest level. Kudus Mohamed was in action for his club side as they were also thumped once again by Napoli. 4-2 attended. Kudus unfortunately could not get in on the action to help influence this game. Steven Bergwijn scored in this one. Brian Broby winning that penalty. Klassen pulled one back but Napoli were just too strong for Kudus Mohamed and his side in Italy tonight. It was not to be for them as they succumbed to that loss. Uh, they have just uh, three points from four games and they could be looking at Europa League football once again. Unfortunate that they start up, started it off uh, with an amazing victory versus Rangers 4-0 uh, uh, but it was not enough to see them at least get a place in the top two. Liverpool, uh, however, in this group have gotten back to winning ways after coming back in match day two versus Ajax they winning that one and they're winning now back to back games versus Rangers the latest one being a 7-1 thumping of Rangers Mohamed Salah coming off the bench to score a hat-trick in five minutes it was a night to remember for the Reds who have answered some critics looking forward to that weekend game in the Premiership uh, versus uh, their arch rivals in Manchester City, who are in red hot forms, who in the, themselves uh, this Champions League midweek uh, had to uh, settle for a draw in that way, uh, which no one thought they would draw it. They have, however, also qualified uh, along with Bayern Munich, uh, who also uh, have qualified through the group stages along with Club Bruges. Interesting night of Champions League football there. Barcelona Inter Milan uh, served as an interesting uh, classic. F3 all, uh, you could have gone anyway. Uh, but Barcelona fans will not be happy. They are staring down the barrel of Europa League appearances. After signing so many amazing, talented players, uh, they are looking at Europa League football. It will be painful uh, to see that happen for some of the fans who would have thought that with this array of stars they have lined up here in the team, they should be top in the group at least here. Uh, Bayern Munich at top. Kamal Soa saw red uh, for two infringements in their game, uh, which saw them qualify. It ended in a draw versus Atletico Madrid. 0-0 draw it ended in. Kamal Soa got a first yellow card uh, for argument. The second one came in to him uh, for uh, with time wasting in the diet and mess of the game, he got it and was sent off. Dennis Odoi was in action uh, for this one here uh, for Club Bruges. Hudson Odoi uh, was in action for his club side uh, by Leverkusen as he lost 3 0 uh, to FC Porto. Uh, fortunately, uh, they, are, do not, they do not know their fate yet. Two more match days to go, uh, they will know. Jeremy Frimpong was suspended after getting a red card in the previous game here. It was a great night of Champions League football. Was happy following it and bringing you the updates here. In the championship, uh, Ghanaian player 
who is in the person of Antoine Semenyo, play for Bristol City as uh, they, they won 2 1 uh, versus Preston North. And Semenyo making his first full appearance from the start. 90 minutes he played here. And it was a great run out for the Ghanaian who is getting back to fitness and looking to play much more regularly ahead of the World Cup. Uh, rumors are making the round uh, now add on it here that uh, coach Otuado's squad uh, for the World Cup, the provisional squad, the 35 man squad will include three locally based players. Yes, and I'll be revealing them to you here as well. They include Dan Lad Ibrahim, according to the stories. Dan Lad Ibrahim is a player that, when I named my possible goalkeeper, some of you thought he should be in there. He is purportedly part of the 35 man squad for the World Cup that will be named by Otoadu next week. Dan Lad has been with the Porcupine Warriors, was part of the title winning team last season, has been impressive for the Porcupines. Unfortunate that he could not make it further with them in the African competition, but Dan Lad has impressed enough, and many of you feel he deserves that national team call up. Dan Lad Ibrahim rumored to be in the final 35 provisional, 35 provisional squad for the World Cup. Another player in there is a free Ebania, purported to be one of the forwards in that lineup that will be named next. A week by Ottoado. A free Ebania has been recently uh, been included in the national team collapse. Recently was involved in that game versus Nicaragua, albeit in the dying embers of the game, was part of the team that trained in Spain uh, for that game, in France as well for that game versus Brazil. He did not play a part in it. It's purported that he is in there. The final one there is Dennis Nkrumah. Corsa, yes, another one who has in recent times been called up, was part of the team that played in the Kirin Cup in Japan. Kuruma uh, Corsa, three of the players who are locally, who are locally based, and have been called into the provisional squad that is going to be named next week. I'll continue my series on it there with the strikers later on this week, but those are the players that. Coach Otuado will be including in his squad for the provisional 35 man list. Rumors are making the rounds that these are the three guys who are in the local league that are going to be there. Happy about it? Excited about it? Let me know what you think in the comments box. So that has been it for today. Talking to you about a roundup of performance of Champions League Ghanaians in action and some interesting stories making the rounds on the night. Match day four over. Five and six to look forward to, and some players who have been called up into the Ghana Black Stars provisional squad who are locally based. The Free Abania, Kosa, and Alad Ibrahim. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy the evening.